Now, when I was a little boy, my dad built me the most amazing swing in our backyard, and it really provided me with endless hours of fun. And now I have a little boy of my own on the way, and I would really like to do the same thing. So this morning, joining me in studio, we have designer and also well-known TV personality, Aiden Bennis, to show me how to build a good quality swing. Aiden, dude, <laughs> very nice to see good you to again, Good to see man. you again, eh? Yeah. What a heartwarming story. I think I had the similar you know, circumstance when I was growing up. Okay, so let's start right at the beginning because yeah. I'm a bit of a DIY man, but you know, I can always learn a bit more. Right, right. <clears throat> we're gonna lay our piece of timber down. So obviously now we have to cut our holes. So what we need to do is make our <clears throat> holes in our wood to be able to, uh, big enough to be able to accommodate the rope. Okay, so with your set square, you wanna measure it up on the corner, you just take it to the zero side. All right. And as you can see, you wanna place a measurement there at 30, and then transfer that across and again. again, 30 there. And then do it the same. All right, so now we've got a nice center mark. I'm just gonna make a little crosshair there. Perfect. All right, and the next step, you grab your trusty drill and a little bit of uh, drilling etiquette just to make sure that everyone's safe at home. Yeah. <laughs> so what you wanna do is obviously plug your drill in. We've got okay. our hole saw, which can be a little bit dangerous, but I'm gonna show you the right way to use it. It's gonna be fine. All right. So first of all, you've got your block of wood. You wanna right. make sure it's nicely clamped down firmly to the table. All right. You always make sure that your hands are out the way of the cutting blade. You place your drill perpendicular to the surface and then yeah. you just go lightly on the trigger until it starts to bite. All right, and also don't drill on a nice table like this. Yeah. Always have <laughs> another piece of wood underneath, I'm sure. <laughs> you said it. All right, cool, so we've pre-made one with holes already. There we go, just right. like that. And this is also the pre-cut size that we've got for the swing seats. Absolutely, absolutely. Right. You know, you wanna oversize your bench seats. So yeah. what you've actually got here is a nice seat at 700 millimeters. Nice. You know, you, you never want the ropes actually cutting into your side, so oversize nice a little bit. Nice and comfy one. Nice and comfy, yeah. Perfect. Maybe you and your boy can sit on them together. You know, I was <laughs> just about to say. Ah, we're looking forward to that. Okay. Okay, so, so we've got that now, we've got everything ready. Mm. Now we need to start assembling it. All right, so what we need to do is create two loops for our ropes to go through, and then we're gonna suspend those from All the right. top. So show us on one horse here quickly. <laughs> okay. So what I've done is actually just cut these to one meter length, yeah. and I've actually taken some of this electrical cord, and finished off the ends here to stop the rope from fraying. Perfect. Okay. Now I'm gonna show you the, the best knot to use for this. So first of all, what you wanna do is actually thread it through the side of the timber. All right. And see it passes nicely through there. And what we need to do is, is turn a figure of eight knot. Okay, hold Perfect. that side. Okay, got it. <clears throat> all right, <clears throat> so you hold your length of rope in your hand there. You come underneath, over, yep. backwards. Come over the rope, under and through. And as you can see right. there, if you actually hold it up, it yeah, actually a makes the shape figure of, eight. of a figure of eight. And what you want to do is just make this nice and neat. The general rule with knots is the neater it is, the safer it is. All right. So as you can see, it now ties on there. And now we can Perfect. tie that back into the hole. And well, as you can see- It's definitely not going to go through anywhere. It's going to sit nice That's and fuss. <laughs> of course. And if you're going to swing on this, you're even going to get any you know, tighter as well. Absolutely. Right. Okay, so we can just do that to the other side quickly. Perfect. Hey, you yeah. do, you're doing well there, man. Yeah. Okay, same figure of eight, nice and tight. All right, and obviously you want to try and make the ends the same length yes, as well. Yes, so it looks nice and neat the whole time. That's it. Okay, we can pull that through. Perfect. All right. So that's, that's it. We've got the final one here with both ropes attached and yeah. it's already been treated with a Dulux wood guard. That's looking fantastic. Right. Look it's got that, a nice eh? finish on it. You can see it's going to be, you know, very long lasting and it's going to wear well with the weather. That's it. And just the final thing we need to do is obviously yeah. uh, we've got our link on there. Now when you do that same knot yeah. on the long length of our rope, obviously it's, you know, we've uh, allowed for you know, a long stretch of rope because we don't know where we can hang it. Yeah. Hopefully you can find a cool spot just now. Oh uh, yeah, we can definitely look for one. <laughs> so what we want to do is actually create a loop on the rope here. So this, for all of your arguments sake, is going to go around the branch? Yes, okay, around cool. the branch. But what we need to do is create a loop here, and now we need to do a double figure of eight, so allow yourself some length of rope there. And the same process again, backwards, around, through, and over, yeah. And there you've got your figure of eight. And as I said earlier, just make it nice and neat. Tighten that guy up. Nice. Ah, gotta use those muscles. <laughs> <laughs> okay, and now what you wanna do is just pass that through and nice firm knot, slide oh, the that. actual fixing method into place. Yeah. And make sure it is nice, nice and, tight and tight on the length there. Give it a nice little twist, you don't want that coming out. Not a chance. And there we go. Perfect. That's it. All right. So should we find a cool place to hang it? I think we should find a cool place to hang it. Aiden, thanks a lot, man. This was awesome stuff. Only a pleasure, only a pleasure. And also, friend. don't forget, very, <laughs> very important, make sure you treat it with your Dulux wood card because you want to make it last for years and years to come, especially in the harsh African climate. And also, don't forget, spot our Dulux dog. We are going to be hiding it very, very soon. Let's <laughs> find a place to hang it, man. All right, Go let's do it. Cool. I got it. 
<laughs> Met Dulax kan jij projecten in en om die huis lag lag aanpak. Benem van Jaarsveld deel een wenk om houtoppervlaktes te verzorg. Benem, my houtdere bij die huis het een beetje aandag nodig. Bij de binnen en buiten kan maak, is nie seker wat om te gebruik. Hoedkaart is die beste product op die markt vir enige van jou houtprodukte. Uh, dit is een premium kwaliteit product wat baie lang gaan hou. En daar is een product wat geskik is vir elke een van jou houtoppervlaktes. Nou daar is so baie verskillende Woodguard producte op die rakke. Waar beginne mens? Jy moet eerst eens besluit wat die oppervlakte. Gaan dit binnenkant wees, gaan dit buitenkant wees. So vir enig iets binnen jou huis, vir al jou meubels om het om het lang dieren te hou en het te beskerm. En dan enig iets van jou houtvensterrame, jou dieren en jou buitenkant sy tuinmeubels ook wat aandag nodig het. Daar is die product geskik vir dit. Loer in by jou naaste Dulux handelaar vir nog opknappingsraad en bly weeksdaar ochende ingeskakel by Expresso vir inspiratie en meer. All right, there we go. There we go. Finishing up. Nice work, man. I had my stunt double, Aiden, in there doing the heavy lifting. <laughs> sure. That looked pretty but simple. There we go. Yeah. Nice one. Nice. Cool. Dude, are you going to put your trust in my handiwork? I, I will. You're going to have okay. a swing. I will. Okay. All right. I'll, I'll push. Dude, look as manly as manly as you can possibly muster as oh, you push on, me on man. this swing. Have you never had a no, friend? Manly. Do it. Lift your feet and go. go. Oh, look at that. Yay. Dude, look at that. awesome. He takes, right, we'll see he you takes guys his life after the break. into his hands. This is so cool, man. I want to have a go.